It's a beautiful September day. Normally I'd be surrounded with people. Oddly, I'm, I'm really missing that crowd atmosphere. Just looking down the street, you'd never know it was the week before Labor Day on the grounds of the Minnesota State Fair. Still, the Fine Arts Building is full of fine art. 1,718 pieces were submitted. Um, that's down uh, significantly from last year. Um, last year we had over 2,700, so we're down about 1,000 works, which is unfortunate, but to be expected during these times. I had even expected maybe fewer submissions than we got. North Hennepin Community College gives out three awards of excellence in the show. On my left is one winner called Mill City, and on my right is another called Blueberry Two. The third award of excellence from North Hennepin Community College went to a sculpture titled Henry's Halloween Hangover. Gallery 5004 in Robbinsdale also sponsors their Artist Exhibition Award. This year's winner was titled Undiscovered Giants of the Mississippi Headwaters. If they go to mnstatefair.org and they go to Fine Arts on the Minnesota State Fair website, we have available a virtual tour kind of like a, a Google Street Tour uh, where you can point and click and move around the gallery. The State Fair also had offered tickets to come see the event, but much like the food parade, they sold out. Still, you will find the online information quite extensive. We have a photograph of each piece, as well as the information of the artist there. Uh, name, the title, the work, the medium, and also if they provided us with a web presence, uh, there'll be uh, their website as well. From the Minnesota State Fair Fine Arts Building, Neil Persley, CCX News. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.